It's Friday, time for another weekly update. This week, I was thrilled to help cut the ribbon at the new East Tennessee Behavioral Health Hospital, which is a partnership between Covenant Health and Acadia Healthcare. I also gave opening remarks at Knox County Schools New Teacher Academy for middle and high school teachers and spoke at Catholic Charities of East Tennessee as they announced the addition of their domestic infant adoption services to their pregnancy help programs. Join me in person and author Sam Quinones via Zoom to discuss his newest book on the devastating drug epidemic, The Least of Us. We'll be at the East Tennessee History Center at noon on August 17th. Sam's previous book, Dreamland, chronicled the suburban heroin crisis. Copies of his book are available at the library. This event is sponsored by the Metro Drug Coalition, All for Knox, and Read to the USA. School mania is back. Please join me next Friday, August 5th, from 3 p.m. to 6 p.m. at Seal Howie Park as we hand out 2,500 school supply bags. This is a drive through event, so you don't even need to leave your car. We start to line cars up at 2 p.m., so be there early as supplies are limited and distributed on a first-come, first-served basis. Many thanks to the nearly 40 donors and sponsors who make this event possible. Again, that's Friday, August 5th, from 3 to 6 at Chilhowee Park. Congratulations and thanks to this month's Employees of the Month, Kim Wallace from the Regional Forensic Center and Kim Kitts from Human Resources. This week's Eat and Greet was at Smokehouse 228. Next Wednesday, I'll be at the new Twisters Shakes and Diner located on Central Street at 1130. Please join me. Until next Friday, I hope everyone has a great week.